as you can see, I got myself a couple new decoys. Uh, these decoys are made by Avian X. We got the half strut Jake and the breeder hen. Now these uh, decoys are called LCD, lifelike collapsible decoy. They are collapsible. They basically have a valve on the bottom. Let me show you. They have a valve on the bottom that you pull out. You can hear the air coming out. You blow on it. And you blow them up. Now, I guess that is a nice feature, but actually probably what I'll do, I'll probably carry them already inflated. That way they'll be easier to set up in a hurry when you need to. Now this is the half strut pose. Avian X also makes a quarter strut Jake, a little bit less aggressive pose. So uh, the whole idea of this guy is to make a gobbler jealous, or even a couple Jakes. This thing is about 75% the size of an actual turkey and the reason being it's supposed to be less intimidating and look like an easy fight so when that gobbler comes across the field or maybe spots it in the woods he's gonna think to himself like I could whoop his butt and a good chance he's gonna come in and try to run this guy off we got the breeder hen let me show you that Got the breeder hen, operates the same way. Has a valve on the bottom right here. You inflate it. Now you could collapse these things down pretty good, but like I said, that's probably not what I'm gonna do. But this is a submissive hen. This is supposed to look like a hen that's ready to breed. And when you pair this up with the Jake, it looks like it might be a good combination to maybe bring out a little bit of jealousy and a tom that's in the woods. All right, each decoy comes with its own carry bag. This thing has a little bit of cat fur on it. My cat's been laying on it. But uh, it's a pretty big size bag. Throw it in there, throw your steak in there. You can cinch it up a little bit, try to keep stuff from falling out. It's got a carry strap on it. Throw it over your shoulder, you're ready to go. These decoys come with a steak. It's kind of self contained deal here. You separate it. You have a bungee cord that keeps both halves together so you won't lose one of them. Now here's what you do when you put them in the ground. The way they are, they're kind of flat on the top. You can push it in. And then you put your, you know, put the other half right in there. Now, I like these decoys. Very, very detailed paint scheme on them is very realistic but there are a couple drawbacks there's a couple things I don't like one of them being they're actually slightly heavy I mean especially the, the Jake the Jake is you know he's pretty heavy when you compare that to some of the hollowed out de decoys you know some of the ones that are made of foam or like a rubber plastic they fold up easy and they're a lot lighter so these do have a little bit of weight but I think uh, the trade-off is in the detail. I believe these will be, you know, pretty deadly, even down to the legs. I mean, the legs even, looks like they even have scales on the legs. So these are the Avian X, Half Strut Jake, and Breeder Hen. I'm hoping to try them out this spring, with the spring gobbler season. I'm really anxious to see what kind of uh, response I'll get from a turkey. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you on my next video.